Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Today I'm going to share with you another lesson I learned. That was a bit costly. Now, as you can see, this wall is flaking. It's not in very good condition. A few stones here. And there, it's flaking rather badly. And the reason is mainly my fault. Well, kind of. As you can see, this wall has been pointed with cement. And that is the worst thing you can do to a limestone wall. Unfortunately, when we dubbed this wall 16 years ago, I didn't have a clue. The person who did the work obviously didn't have a clue either. And so now, 16 later, years later, we're here trying to fix the damage. Cement is the worst thing you can do, again, to a limestone wall. Why? Because limestone needs to breathe. It's like a sponge. Water goes in, into the wall, and you want the humidity to go out. Now, unfortunately, when you put cement in the wall, the water is forced to go out through the limestone rather than through the mortar, which is as it should be, if it's done correctly and the person who did the work knows what he's doing. As you can see, the cement here, the wall was up to here. All that's left this bit is the cement. Now, if this were done properly, i.e. with lime mortar, all the humidity in the wall would come out through the lime mortar because it is, it breathes, so to speak. But with cement, all the walls coming out through the stone. So, that is what causes this flaking. Let's go over here. And it's the same thing. See, this is cement. This is a powdery wall. Again, cement was used when it shouldn't have been. Many people will tell you the stone is sick, which is a load of fuey. <laughs> but, well, simply the work was done wrong. And now it has to be done again. All the cement has to come out and be replaced with lime. the proof of this I can show you here take this wall for example no cement here I mean the lime needs to be but then again it needs to be repointed because it's been a while but look at the stone since no cement was used here look at the difference Yeah, the stone is fine, not even dusty. But we go here, cement, cement, cement. And we have problems. Another problem here is the tiles. Again, back then, I wish I knew. I didn't. But, as you can see here, maybe just zoom in here. Zoom in. There is a damp proof course. Now, Let 
you see it? Okay, when we lay the tiles here, the temple, of course, was bypassed. So you see, here we are, as layers pointing out, bypassing the damp roof course. Again, back then into the ignorance was bliss, I didn't have a clue. Today I know better. Now, the only solution would, for this is, other than lowering the floor, <laughs> would be to cut a channel to lower the floor near the wall. Anyway, so to reiterate, don't ever please put cement in a limestone wall. Thank you very much. Until the next time.